Hey guys, Harsh here from Shark Me Loud and welcome to another video episode. Today we are going to talk about something very interesting and this is about Facebook instant articles. So few days back Facebook has made an uh, instant article available for all the publishers and today I am going to show you how to integrate that with your blog. Uh, you can integrate it with any website if you are even if you don't have WordPress, if you are using any other platform you can do that. This guide is specifically for WordPress so you can start following this guide. I will make sure that I will be a little slow so that you would be able to follow each and every step. I would suggest pause the video wherever. Uh, you are stuck complete the process complete the step then come back then start playing the video and complete the whole process so this won't take more than 10 to 15 minutes and if you do this I'm very sure you would see a lot of traffic coming to your blog from the Facebook so let's get started for this tutorial I'll be configuring the same for one of my blog wpfreesetup.com and uh, just to let you know there is an official WordPress plugin called instant articles for WP so we need to install that plugin just to be sure because there are so many plugins you need to check like the authors have, uh, should be automatic and Facebook so it's an official plugin uh, there will be no problem using this so uh, I'm inside the dashboard installing the plugin I searched for instant articles for WP and um, let's inst install the plugin let's activate the plugin and now the next thing is uh, we need to configure the plugin so let's go to the plugin settings page uh, that you can access from directly from here and this is where everything starts all right so basically we need to create a facebook app id and app secret so i'll show you how to do that just follow this follow the steps it's pretty easy and it will be done within minutes all right let's go let's get started with that click here and you'll be taken to this page where developers.facebook.com click on add a new app let's select website over here uh, let's give it a meaningful name so WP in free setup instant article so you might want to use your domain name instant article for quick uh, so that you can recognize it easily click on create new Facebook app ID uh, you need to provide a contact email that's, and select the category in the category use apps for pages click on create app ID so once that is done, uh, scroll down to the bottom and here you would, uh, see this option where you need to add your website address and click on next. So once this is done, uh, scroll to the top, click on skip quick start and we are on the dashboard. So here we already have our app ID and app secret over here. So you can go to settings and copy your app ID and app secret. So to see the app secret, you need to click on show. Let me just quickly copy this back to instant article settings. So once you have copied the app ID and app secret, you need to click on next. That's pretty easy. Uh, the one important thing we need to do, which we haven't done so far, we need to make our app live. So, so go back to the app development page and here click on app review. So here you would see this option. Your app is in development mode and unavailable to the public. Just make it uh, change it to yes. Click on confirm. And that's it your app is live so this part is done now uh, let's go back to our wordpress setting page uh, we are here here we need to log in with our facebook id and select the page that we have created for the app so let me quickly do that and if you see this error at the top like this simply ignore that we uh, we don't need to worry about this this should take about a few seconds and now select your page which is actually not here now let's let's start doing the instant article configuration because that is one important step we need to do before we can add our page all right um, so click on sign up for instant article here and on this page you need to select the web page on which you want to enable the facebook instant article so se i've selected wp free setup over here and access instant article tools that's it everything happens instantly and it would be and now we are inside our instant article pay, uh, settings page so you can always go to your facebook page click on the settings at the top then click on the instant articles and you'll be here all right so now let's do all this step one by one now number one and the most important thing is you need to claim your url so uh, this is the meta tag you need to add to your blog so let me quickly go back to 
settings since I'm using Genesis if you're using Genesis you can click on Genesis theme settings and here you see the option called header script you can also use Google Tag Manager or any other plugin which let you add script at the header portion or you can also edit your WordPress header.php file to add this meta tag it's up to you what option do you want to use uh, it's a good idea that you also purge your cache if you're using super cache plugin w3 total cache or any other cache plugin simply purge on purge the cache i'm using site drawn hosting so they have this plugin called purge sg cache so once that is done go back to the page add add your domain name and that's it your articles are well your domain has been verified so this is one important step now the second step is your production RSS feed. All right, so, so go to your blog address and since you already have the plugin installed, you just need to add forward slash feed forward slash instead articles. And if you open this page, you should be seeing something like this. If you see something like this, that means you, the feed for your instead article has already been uh, configured. So you just need to copy this link and paste it over here. That's it, click on save and you'll get this option. So Facebook will automatically keep checking your feed. Before that, we need to do a few things. Let's let's get those things done, okay? One of the most important thing is the style. So the next step is that we need to submit our feed to Facebook for the review. This is uh, for the only one time that we need to do once that is done. Once Facebook approves our feed, from there, uh, you know, everything will be automatic. And I'll tell you one secret after this that will help you to speed up the process all right so uh, number one thing is click on default so this is basically to configure the style of your instant article uh, i'm sure like over the time this would change but for now let, let's stick to whatever we have right now so here you need to upload an image with the size 690 by 132 pixels and i've already created that image if you have not if you don't have that size of logo you can simply create any you know like blank canvas and add your blog name just to uh, and then you can of course change your logo at the later stage so let me quickly upload the logo so here i've uploaded the logo and click on save that's it now click on cancel to go back and most of my work uh, is already done now so one of the step important step is like we need to go back and add our page over here so let's quickly click on update we need to again add our app id and app secret so you know that's that's time taking but let's quickly get it done with so i've already i've added app id and app secret again and then log click on login with facebook now this time you should be able to see your new page so yeah here's the page which where i've already configured where we i was configuring everything you should be able to see your page over here now click on next and that's it so we are almost done and I, when i say almost done that now few steps still left that should not take more than five minutes so let's finish the final step and that is basically submit for review you know like we have to create 10 articles and we have to submit them for review now 10 articles either you can just wait when you start publishing articles maybe in next 10 days or 30 days you can create the, those 10 articles or what you can do here is go back to your WordPress dashboard, click on post and open, you know, published post. So you know what, what you need to do is like open 10 of your already published post in uh, edit mode. So I'll just open one and I'll show you what you need to do is just need to open it and just click on update. All right. So you don't need to make any changes. You just need to open 10 of your articles in edit mode and click on update. So what this will do, this will add 10 of the articles to the RSS feed and now you can quickly submit your Facebook instant article for a review. So let me quickly finish those 10 thing and then I will let you know what, what's next. So I've just finished editing and updating 10 of my already published posts and now what we need to do, let me quickly refresh this page. You need to quickly, ref you also need to refresh your page since you and me are doing at the same time all right, so you can see here, uh, you know, that we have already created 10 articles. We just need to click on submit for review. And that's it. Uh, the articles were submitted for review. Now we need to wait for 
two to three days depending upon how fast Facebook will approve our application. So now whenever we publish an article it will be and when user will be checking it on their mobile app it will be shown as the instant article which will be really fast and so if you have already finished all this step you're already sorted so here it says it would take about three to five business days to review your application and once your application is reviewed approved you know people would be able to see your article as instant article and you can see a lot of traffic so i'll add few other things in the uh, article which i'm writing for shout me loud so you can see the link in the description where you will be finding a few more tips which will help you to like you know monetize so one thing which i really want to talk about is the audience network now this section is basically uh, you can also monetize your facebook instant article uh, using audience net network so so think of this as adsense for facebook uh, this is pretty cool so more or less these are the steps that you need to do when con to configure facebook instant article uh, i would recommend you to like check out the link in the description go to the uh, official blog post which i have written on shout me loud i'll find something new i'll update in the blog post and you can be updated with the latest information uh, do let me know uh, how is this video how was the video I know I went a little fast uh, in between but you know that is the nature of the whole guide and that is how I am but I hope you enjoyed this video and in the upcoming videos I'll share more such tips if you like this video do share it with your friends do click on the like because it really helps and I'll see you soon bye bye take care this is Harsh